Hello everybody, it's uh, Saber Wolf, and yeah, it's been a while since I uh, did any kind of streaming or anything. But since it's Christmas Eve, it's a, kind of a fun day here today. Um, I figured, let me get this thing over here, come on. Yeah, unfortunately the uh, pups uh, also use this to call their mother at night, so this kind of gets messed up sometimes. There we go. <clears throat> so yeah, so like I said, it's Christmas Eve, uh, I figured I'd do a little stream for you all. Um... Do uh, Henry Stickman. Now, it's been quite a long time since I played Henry Stickman. I think it's been about six or seven years since I played the Henry, uh, Henry Stickman series, but I saw it on Steam that they uh, decided to bring out the whole entire series of Henry Stickman. So I figured, why not play the whole thing over again? So I thought that was kind of cool. So. That should be good for y'all. Um, so, yep, so I want to play us a little bit of Henry Stickman, so why not try this, so, shall we? There we go. So yeah, so let's get into it, shall we? Now, I, now the, thing, the cool thing about this is that you have to play it in order uh, from getting in. Now, when you play it online through the browser, you kind of, there was chances of you kind of playing them out of order. Uh, for that, so this actually makes it a little better in that respect, where you can actually, it forces you to play the game in order. Because it is a story that you progressively go through, uh, if you've never heard of Henry Stickman or anything. Uh, originally started as a browser game on the Stickman website, I think it was, and it was the by far probably the most popular uh, stick figure, like the circle with the body with the two arms and just two legs. That's it. Um, but this was the most like intuitive and funniest like probably of the little stick games. I played some other ones on there, but this was by far probably the better, most most fun one to play. This is a clean account. I like do like how the fact that you can clear out the data, so if somebody else wants to play it, they can play it without having any of the spoilers or anything in front on the screen already. So I thought that was kind of nice to have that option. Um, so I do. I'm challenging uh, Varus to play this game at some point. I don't know if we'll stream it or not, but I am going to challenge her to try to play this game too, because it is a fun game to play. So let's further ado, let's get into Breaking the Bank. I do remember a lot of the things of how to do this game, or the choices, but I'm going to try to uh, play, the <laughs> play the most uh, interesting ones, at least, the uh, what I think of. Now, I know Disguise works uh, pretty well. I'm going to probably try Disguise for now. Um, I... You see here, let's try Shovel first, actually. Achievement, get Shovel. Mm hmm? Oh. I like how the car alarm went off. <laughs> Never dig straight down. Yeah, that's a Minecraft reference. <laughs> All right, let's try. Let's do this guy's one. I think that's the most interesting one. Yeah, how did he tie the outside of that? I don't know. Eh? How did we lose one? I think we should throw it in the back, just to be safe. <laughs> you ever wonder why there's a bank out here? Mm, well, I think it's supposed to be like more of a vault, you know. Oh, that makes sense. Red versus blue reference. <coughs> cool. Hmm. Freeze! Don't move. Well, that was short lived. A little short lived on that one. The story begins. Okay, there we go. Oh, I just go straight to prison? I don't even get a chance to, like. Wow. Oh, okay, that was quick. You're free to go. <laughs> Not really. Oh, what a jerk. Package. It's a piss 
I Don't get your hopes there. up. We've already checked it for anything useful, haven't we, Dave? What? Yeah, yeah, <laughs> of course I checked it. I mean, if I didn't check it, I'd lose my job, and I don't lose my job. <laughs> wow. See you around. Some, somebody going to get fired. <laughs> hmm. By the way, chat is available, so you guys can uh, hit me up in chat or whatever if you want as well. Let me expand up a little bit. There we go. All right, so we got, let's see, cell phone, rocket launcher, file, energy drink. Let's try, you know what? Let's go digital. Let's go cell phone. Oh, well, first call you make is to your attorney. I guess he didn't um, get his uh, chance to call somebody, I guess, when he got thrown in jail. Witness, please continue your testimony. Okay. Witness I was testimony. I alongside my partner, the armored man, but generally <laughs> spotted a bag on the side of the road. We got out and eventually decided to throw the bag in with the others. We didn't know there was someone hiding in there. OBJECTION! So, the defendant crawled into that bag in order to break into the bank. Is that correct? Is it not obvious? Is it really that obvious? I have proof that the defendant didn't hide himself in that bag. Well then, what are you waiting for? Present this evidence already. Why would they turn these badge security footage? A mysterious device, which I didn't use. So the only way you have is security footage in the bag. Those are the only two things that could have. Tell me. Take that. There we go. Is is that the bag the defendant hid in? Yes, but there's one thing that's been bothering me. If the defendant really was hiding in this bag, then... How did he tie the knot from the outside of the bag? What? If he was inside the bag, it'd be impossible for him to tie that knot on the outside. I always wondered about that. <laughs> but then, how did he do it? It's simple. He didn't. <laughs> what are you saying? What are you saying? He wasn't hiding in that bag at all. He was stuffed in there. By this very witness! What? <laughs> As you can see by this doctor's analysis, the defendant had taken quite the beating. While he was in the bag, he was unconscious! D oh, I presented the other story. evidence too, okay. <laughs> the witness was attempting to dispose of the body. He left the defendant in the bag, knowing he'd drive by it on the way back to the bank. When the witness and his partner passed the bag, he convinced his partner to throw the bag in with the others. But, but well, why he did he convince the bag to throw the bag why, in the others. He of the body, of course. There are millions of bags of money in that bank, and the witness knew it would take a long time before the victim was found. But unfortunately for the witness, his victim woke up and tried to escape from his tomb. He was arrested on the spot, and the witness thought everything was over. But it's come back to haunt him now. You guys can't, you can't, this, this, this can't be happening to me! <laughs> well, that certainly was an interesting trial. However, I am now ready to deliver my verdict. I find the defendant, Henry Stickman, Not guilty, baby. Yeah, the round person eating outside the courthouse. Yep, yeah, that's so true. All right, next. Oh, okay, so now we go into episode two. Okay, cool. So yeah, and this is cool how they're all connected together. I hereby declare the Tunisian archaeological exhibit open. Ooh. Yeah, thank you. $112 million diamond. Okay, apparently I have keys. Rent's 10 days late. That's that's not good. <laughs> that's probably why we're heisting the bank. Bust in or sneak in? We're going to sneak in. Or sneaky sneak. Hmm. But how do I sneak in? Oh, shrink ray, pick, liquefaction. I don't think liquefaction would even work right. Anti-gravity cap and jump hop. Let's do a jump hop. That sounds like the most... Uh, wrong way, bud. Oh. Of course, uh, I gotta remember the most obvious... Obvious is probably not the best way to go in. 
Okay, climb. Ow. Apparently, there's something in that cake. And, uh, okay, that's just blast. Just I just blasted my wind. I didn't even stink in. Pretty lame, huh? Yeah, I don't really like this. Uh, please, shut up. Oh, I just, I was, I was just trying to have a conversation. Uh, gun. Yeah, why would they put a loaded gun and up in for a show? I just, I just, I just to have a uh, plane. Uh, <coughs> I gotta warn some. Ooh, that guy's. Oh. Ah. Uh, okay. Well. Sneak past the other way. Ah. Oh, that's a second way in. Okay, cool. Oh, but there's two guards in there. Um, good ball. Pokemon. Unknown. Cool. <laughs> uh, alien. Okay, well, I guess they don't like listening to me now, do they? <laughs> Alright, guess we'll go for Shroman. Okay, apparently getting the big mushroom makes you like uh over too. Shoot <laughs> shoot a cannon inside? Ooh, cannonball got me though. Holy crap, the place is wrecked. Chaos containment. Uh sir? Y you might want to come look at this. I'm getting chaos readings at 10.6. It's coming from the museum. My god, it's over nine? Yeah. I'm leaving this decision up to you, Corporal. Tens of Just hit one of those buttons to deal with this pressing situation. Who's watching TV? Get back to work. Whoa. Sorry, Chief. I'm going back to work yet, so. Nuclear detonation satellite. Some other thing and dividing by zero. Well, dividing by zero can't doesn't work. So let's go by this. Oh, robot! Hello. Well, that took the attention off me. Oh, I didn't get the diamond, though. Aw, oh, I didn't get the diamond, though. Hey! Hello. Sweet. Okay then, got the diamond. Now what? Well, well, look who finally decided to wake up. Uh, You've been quite elusive, oh, but government. your skills make you worth the catch. You'll be perfect for the job. We've been having some issues with a group of thieves known as the Top Hat Clan. We know they're guilty, we just can't pin them down in crimes. Hmm. You'll be going into the airship to bring them down. I don't need to remind you that we've got you on several charges. Attempted robbery, 
breaking yourself out of prison, <laughs> even stealing a Tunisian. I never myself out of prison. I got out legit. A lot of counts on you. Do this job right, and we'll drop all charges against you. Charlie yep, will be bad chance. close to the airship. And the rest, Charlie. Is up to you. Find a way to bring him down, and you'll be a free man. Hey, uh, how do you want me to bring you in? Uh, oh. Sticky hand, grappling gun, and earpiece, and cannonball. Let's try sticky hand. Hey, all right. Zero point energy. Well, that's not what I thought I was going to do with that. I am full chain. Hey, did you hear something over there? Nah, man. I didn't hear nothing. Uh... That was it? Okay, well, there's no other way of going about this, so <laughs> we gotta go back to the uh, beginning here. <laughs> okay. Um, earpiece. Check, check, this is Charles. Said I'd uh, give hey, you Charles. a Hey, uh, Charles. There's a guy down there, a bad guy. So, uh, yeah. Good luck. Mmm. Mmm, acid. Uh, okay, um, yeah, I didn't allow for the wind. Fuck. Well, you know... I was gonna try choke him out or something. Fine, vacuum. I do remember that anything you pick with Charles probably doesn't work. <laughs> but we're going to do it anyways just for All this. Right, here I come. Just for the memes. <laughs> so stupid. Alright, roll the helicopter. Right, hey, Tails. Okay. It's, uh, no, that, that, that I'm just gonna die if that happens. Ugh. Oh man, I remember this. Thing nobody knows about this, or we'd be in a lot of trouble. Uh, I fucking kick. Welcome. Well, okay. <laughs> oh man, I remember this. Think nobody knows about this, or we'd be in a lot of trouble. Ah, uh, spooky. Oh, hello, Mr. Spider. All right, here 
Hi, you got some evidence. Oh, wait, wait. Whack. There's no way you're getting through there. Lots of guys, and there's lots of guns. That's all I'm gonna say. It looks like you can get around if you go through that air duct. All right, I've hacked into their power grid. What do you want me to do? Uh, reroute the power. Okay, I'll reroute the power to a random room. That's fine. <laughs> All right, Henry, you're almost there. I'm right outside, so... In the dark room. Doors, and I'll, uh, get you on the chopper. Hey, what are you doing? Yeah, uh, we got a situation down in the cargo bay. Uh, flashbang. Fire in the hole. Yeah, that was bright. <laughs> Force gun. Hey, there's a button on your earpiece. You should press it. I had that thing the whole time? What's going? Hmm. This could be a problem. Yeah, you better know that's a problem. Hey. Fleeing the complex. Wait, how to get into the complex? Ah, uh, hello, Henry. Welcome to the wall. Some of the most cunning and notorious criminals are kept here. But I, my record was swept because I did the government thing. You're going to be here for a long time. Grigori. Oh. I was double crossed. Wait here until cell found. Uh, boost. <laughs> yeah, that'll get her attention. <laughs> You help me, I help you. Thanks. Hey. And I'm like, look at how much I care. <laughs> I don't care. I ended up buffing up my guys and doing like 70 damage. This <laughs> is like <laughs> the Will 7 Golden Eye. Uh, Super Science Takedown. Cool. If we can get you up there, you could get in and open this door. Uh, Juthro. Oh! Uh, well, I thought she was a little stronger than that. Um, the farce. Oh, okay. She has the force, apparently. <laughs> what was that guy doing up top? Uh, start moving the table. Um, that's not how it's supposed to work. Hey, I just grabbed these. Maybe they'll come in handy. I thought you press. Uh, uh, what's best way? Third floor. We'll help them clear out maximum security. What do you think? Duh, I like. Who get the guards? Well, that wasn't very nice. Toss? Sure. I'll try tossing it. There is convict here. Ooh. Help! Back to your cell, inmate. Make a face. What, you think that will upset me? Oh, very much. Thanks, I guess. <laughs> Let's get out of here. 
Uh, uh, yeah, that way. Well, if it isn't him, there has not been an incident here in 50 years. And the day you show up this happens, no. you are going to regret everything. Mm -hmm. Hey! Sweet! Get out! Only two fails, so it's not bad. Completing the mission. Ah! Oh, so this is depending on the combination stuff. Oh, hmm, interesting. So the only thing I can do is government-supported private investigator with busted-out convict with Ellie with a warden defeated. Lunch. Actually, I should have lunch then. So I get the hat clan arrested, and we bust it out of the wall. You sure this is where he's going to pick us up? Ah, there he is. You said you did some work with him in the past or something? If you trust him, then so do I. Yeah. Hey, Henry. Nice to see you again. Who's your friend? I'm Ellie. Well, nice to meet you. Any friend of Henry's is a friend of mine. So, uh, I was able to swing by and pick you guys up, but, well, you remember the captain. Yeah, he, he had to sanction this pickup. In return, we're gonna need your assistance again. The top hats. Again. I hope that's alright. Well, it is the least we could do. He is helping us out. Good. Let me fill you in on the details when we get into the air. There's always a catch when it's the government. Alright, so what's left of the top hat clan is set up a, some sort of secret base out in the jungle. Seems like they're planning on launching a, some kind of space station into orbit. They'll be sitting pretty if they pull this off, so we gotta make sure that they don't do that. I talked to the general and he said he's pulling out all our main forces. He said that Henry and I made a good team last time, so I trust that we can pull it off. Henry and I make a pretty good team too. Don't count me out. Then we're gonna make a great squad. The three of us hmm. will have no problems. <laughs> yeah, okay. That's yeah, like the Washington no like, we can get there or whatever on top. Where are we the dropping, boys? Uh, let's drop at the... Uh, let's parachute at the backside there. Oh, shit. Blitz in chewing gum. Okay, well, I guess we can't land there. Let's land in the tower. We got some delinquents on the window of the control tower. I'll take care of it. Yeah, I was just about to close up. Okay, fine. Let's land... Let's land on top of the thing. I don't think that's how it works that way. Okay, well, I guess it's this way. With jetpacks? Oh! It was weirdly smooth. Oh, we so took out the gun turret, cool. <laughs> the rocket will be launching very soon. Please get on board immediately. I will not hesitate to leave you behind. Uh oh, sounds like they're about to take off. You guys should get over there right away. I'll be down to help there was two hours before takeoff. Uh, barrel. Donkey Kong reference. Right here, combo time. A uh, cannon. Funny story. Uh, this cannon was actually built to fire humans. It's kind of weird. Well, on your butt. Wow, that worked. Now, quick, guys, you gotta stop that rocket from taking off. Um. Got a little bit of a situation. Oh, hello. <clears throat> uh, Yo. downgrader.
Okay, that's not how I thought it was going to work. Yo! Diversion? Maybe Charlie would can divert me. Turn down for what? Even Charles digging it. Situation sorted. That's dumb. Oh, but okay, we're taking right, off. The rocket's launching. We gotta do something. Really, you don't say. We need to come up with a plan, quick. Hmm. Hmm. Huh. Uh, Charlie's plan never works. Let's go with Ellie. She's smart. All right, smart. guys, listen up. I got a plan. Henry and I will overload the engine room, causing an explosion. Charles, we'll need you to wait outside the auxiliary exhaust by the forward left booster. We'll only have about 20 seconds to get out before it blows. All right, I'll be ready. Now hurry. Where is he? All right, I'm in position. I don't see you guys, though. Uh, man, Charles. Seems oh, like Henry's my got plan. a plan. So, uh, yeah, yeah. I oh, said yeah. one word. So. Yeah, that's a great idea. All right, you guys do your thing. I'll be ready. What? Who's that? Oh, go into main control room and reset the course Did to. You the autopilot. All right then. Let's go. Autopilot. You just bailed out at like a bajillion feet and get sliced in half by the. Well, that pepper was gonna kill me. What a move! Can't believe we did it. Where'd you end up sending the rocket anyway? To the wall. Yup. That was a lot of fun. You know, feel free to call us if you got any more jobs to do together. Yeah. Right, Henry? Hey, triple threat through musketeers. Oh, is that it? Hey, cool. Um, so yeah, that was a whole set. So I guess depending on how your other paths go is how you end up here. And yeah, that was the end of it. So I'd have to go all the way back to the beginning again. To the bank. Cool. We'll run through it one more time. We'll try different uh, picks this time and we'll see where we go. Hmm. Now, I know shovel doesn't work and I know disguise works. We already used it. So let's try. Ooh. Uh, let's try laser. Cool. Uh, open sesame. <laughs> Ball like a wrecking ball. Huh? What? Oh. Well, how do they know? Fine, just blow a hole in it. This is why you don't stack things on top of other things. Well, I guess teleporter. Ah! Uh. Well, it has to be disguised. Disguise the only one. Did we lose one? I think we should throw it in the back, just to be safe. You ever wonder why there's a bank out here? Well, 
I think it's supposed to be like more of a vault, you know? Oh, that makes sense. That was it. There was only one selection you can make. Oh, interesting. Okay, well, on that note, then, um, so we already know we, the bank is there's only one path to go to. So I will come back later because, again, it's Christmas Eve. Got family stuff going on today and tomorrow. So I'm going to come back and do some more of this uh, later tonight. Uh, so well, now we know we gotta start at the escape the prison. So I guess this is like a prefix. Yeah, it's a prologue. Okay. So we'll start back again. We're gonna do escape the prison again, but we're gonna choose a different path to try to get out of it. All right. So I'll clip this off now. I'll be on back on later to this, uh, this evening tonight. Uh, fortunately, I'm working uh, every single day starting Christmas Day. I'm working every single day of the week until uh, January 5th, I believe, <laughs> or January 6th. Um, yeah. Uh, unfortunately, my job, I work every day of the week except for Thursday right now. So, for the next, like, week and a half. Or two weeks, really. Uh, so, yeah. That's just the way it goes sometimes. But, um, when my new schedule does start, I'm starting to have to go into work in at, like, 8 o'clock in the morning. So, I can stay up a little bit later. So, after the kids go to bed, I can do some streaming soon. So, that plan is still in, uh, in the works. So, I do plan on doing more streaming. Uh, so right now, I got a lot of stuff going on in the background at home, stuff like that. So I want to get that all squared away. So starting in January, like I said before, when I start doing the uh, like 8 a.m. shift at work, I can stay up a little bit later, so I can sleep in a little bit later. So it works out in the end, and you guys get to uh, get that, get the wreath rewards for that. So I can start playing that Guild Wars and stuff like that. But I knew I had a limited time today, so just this, just the uh, reminisce on some Henry Stickman. So. Alright guys, I'll do it for now, so take care and uh, have a good day.